Hello YouTube, this is Daz of the Cameraman. Today is Monday the 20th of July 2015, New Zealand time. It's just gone 10 a.m. New Zealand time, and as we can see, the time in Croatia right now is just after 12 a.m. I'll just refresh the page so that we can see that that is current. 12.03 a.m. Monday 20th of July 2015, time in Cro Croatia. So I'm just about to give Igor uh, Costellis a call on Skype and uh, let's see if he's ready to talk. So I've got uh, Skype open here for I Igor Costellis. It appears that he has accepted my uh, contact details here so maybe he is ready to go. It's, he is showing us offline but he may be set to invisible. So let's give him a try and uh, see if he's ready to talk. And as we can see, there has been no answer on that call. So let's try sending him a text. Hello, Igor. Are you ready to talk? As agreed. I'll even give him a smiley face. And uh, while we wait to see if there's any response from Igor, uh, let's just take a look at um, the messages that were left under his video, Professional Stalkers, which he uploaded on July 18, 2015. And uh, I've already featured in one of my videos. Under this thread here, by roaching it up F, you can see that there's a message thread um, now apparently these comments, my initial comments, did apparently go into Igor's spam folder, which does unfortunately happen with, with the new YouTube system. I often get this uh, happening on my channel as well, where people leave uh, legitimate comments and unfortunately they go to the spam folder and they will stay there and nobody will see them until they are cleared. And it's a constant battle of trying to keep up with, uh, with legitimate comments. Uh, to make sure that they can be seen by all. And apparently that is what happened with my initial comments with Igor. Apparently I'm not blocked. Uh, people can see these comments and reply. Uh, so that would indicate that Igor has cleared them. Um, now, initially Igor accused me of basically being an anonymous coward hiding behind a false profile, which is not true, of course. He was talking about my Dazza, the cameraman YouTube profile, as being anonymous. Um, but the fact is that if you go to the About tab on my YouTube channel, you will find links to my personal Facebook page, which is uh, a real profile. My name, yes, my name is really David Gregg. I am who I say I am. I live in New Zealand. I don't work for the government. I don't work for the Illuminati or the powers that be or or anything crazy like that. I'm just an ordinary person with a lifelong interest in astronomy. I've uh, been been an amateur astronomer for, for many years and uh, you know as I say I've, I've been interested in astronomy since I was a young child. So I've been interested in astronomy for almost 40 years um, and I am an active member of my local astronomical society. I'm on the committee and I do present items at the Astronomical Society. The Astronomical Society. I also guide groups there from time to time as we have visitors. Um, but anyway, getting back to the point, uh, Igor did challenge me to front up, and I said, certainly I'll front up. I'll talk to you face to face on Skype, and we will discuss your claims, and I will answer your questions, and you can answer mine. And so I put down the, the challenge to uh, Igor to talk to me on Skype and initially he um, refused and uh, basically tried to wriggle out of it by saying that uh, I have an advantage because uh, 
English is not his first language, but obviously he speaks English pretty well in his videos, and he presents uh, his videos in English, he, he comments in English, so he should have no problem in fronting up and, and talking in English. And in any case, I, as I have said to Igor, I would make allowances for the fact that English is not his first language, and of course I would be respectful and allow him to speak without talking over him. So I've notified Igor that um, I would be calling him at the agreed time. Uh, let's just have a look at some um, screenshots of um, messages that uh, we swapped about talking on Skype. Um, if I can find the right ones here. Okay, uh, there was a, a particular um, comment that I was looking for um, where Igor said that yes, he would be there. Um, maybe I can find that later, but let's give Igor another call and uh, see if he's ready to talk now. Now apparently Igor's surname, I was pronouncing it, I was pronouncing it Kostalak earlier. Uh, apparently it is pronounced Kostalis. Um, I'm taking that uh, pronunciation from what Igor has said in one of his videos himself. So as you can see it says here call failed, no answer. Um, so that's two calls now. He hasn't responded to my text message here. Um, as well as doing a video, um, I've also sent him messages um, via YouTube here, which he has obviously seen. Um, I posted this 11 hours ago. Uh, a message to Igor Costalis regarding our Skype call as agreed. I will be calling you at midnight your time as agreed. And he replied four hours ago, I will call you when I get enough information uh, who I am dealing with. And to that comment I replied, uh, my name is David Gregg, I live in New Zealand, I am an amateur astronomer and I am on the committee or board of the Tauranga Astronomical Society. I am who I say I am. I will be happy to answer the questions you raised in your videos when I talk to you on Skype at midnight, your local time, as you agreed. And uh, I gave him updates to let him know that um, I would be calling him uh, in 30 minutes time at midnight, his local time as he agreed, and I let him know that if he does not answer I will go ahead and post the video of me calling him and I will show how after he accused me of being an, an anonymous coward that he would not front up and talk to me. Um, so there we have it. Uh, after accusing me of being an anonymous coward uh, Igor Kostelak has refused to uh, front up, uh, as he agreed to do. He, he requested that um, our Skype conversation be at midnight, his local time, because the internet traffic would be less. And I suppose now he's going to say that uh, uh, he couldn't get online, uh, never mind the fact that he doesn't seem to have any problem uploading uh, multiple videos to his YouTube channel. Let's give him one more try. I don't want this video to be too long. And there we go. No answer. So it is now 12 minutes past midnight um, local time for Igor. And uh, no answer from Igor. No response. No text message. Nothing. So um, uh, my offer still stands to Igor. I will be happy to talk to him face to face on Skype. I will turn on my camera and he can see my face. I have appeared on camera previously. Uh, I don't find the need to uh, appear in front of the camera on my videos uh, for most of my debunking videos, but when it is somebody that uh, I'm talking face to face, then I'm quite prepared to go uh, on camera as I have done before with uh, Alfred Weber. And um, so there we have it. Uh, the, the door is still open to Igor Costellis. 
uh, I'm still happy to talk via Skype or via a live Google Plus Hangout. Um, and I'm quite happy to answer all those questions that uh, Igor raised in his uh, recent video. And um, maybe he can answer questions uh, for me as well. Thank you for watching and uh, stay tuned for updates.